Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today, I will be showing you how to use GenCraft AI Photo and Video Generator. So let's get started. First, all you have to do is to go to any web browser and sign up for an account. So here, you just have to type GenCraft AI or GenCraft and click the very first link that appears here. To create an account, you just have to click Login or Generate. And before we do that, a little bit introduction about this GenCraft AI. GenCraft is the most potent AI art generator available today, enabling you to convert text into original images, artwork, and movies. Make original designs that you can download and distribute. Simply enter a prompt, select one of their beautiful designs. So as you can see, you can sign up or sign in to GenCraft using your Google account with Facebook and with Apple. But for easier way, you can connect or simply connect your Google account to your GenCraft. And here it is. The first thing to see here or the first thing that will pop up is a disk. So if you upgrade to Pro, then you can unlock all these features, okay, if you want to upgrade. So for the meantime, let's just exit this and let's go to GenCraft interface. So this is GenCraft and you will see here that I have five prompts remaining because I'm using the basic version. So if I want to upgrade my plan, then all I have to do is to click upgrade. We have here the bell notification and your profile. If you click this, you will see this options, fan limit, lead help and settings. So. If you want to log out, you could also tap log out if you want and switch to other account. Now to start, you can enter some prompts here. For example, I'm going to show you an example keywords for prompts to start, but actually everything is up to you. So for example, here is my prompt, a uh, peaceful for a scene as the sun rises and so on. Okay. So this is just an example. You can add your photo if you want, but for this time, you just have to use prompts and words. For select style, it's optional, but you could choose which style you want. For example, I want my photo to be realistic, but actually there are tons of styles here that you can choose. So we have your nature and we have the anime, but for our tutorial, let me choose first this realistic. Okay, select model and then you can choose hyper realism and you can also select other models right here. Okay. But for this tutorial, let me choose this hyper real. Okay, so advanced settings, you will see here options such as exclude from result. For example, if you want to exclude some keywords like sign, scenes, or for example, below darkness, if you want to exclude blurry background, everything is up to you. So let's just say, for example, I want to exclude lion, elephant, and roses. Then in the result, I cannot see this or there's zero possibility that these elements or these, you know, our words or pictures will appear. Also for aspect ratio, you can choose from square, landscape, portrait, and so on. Once everything is okay, then you can click generate and wait for a couple of seconds as it is processing. You can read more instructions below. You can explore more while waiting and just go back to this section. But let's just wait. And this is the result successfully generated. So this is a the result of my prompt. A peaceful forest scene as the sun rises. And I can see an elephant, lion, blurry background, and so on here. So as you can see, if you scroll down here, you will see this option such as publish, animate, download HD, magic edit. But for animate and magic edit, you have to upgrade your plan in order for you to use this. So scroll down to see more related pictures and images from GenCraft community. Okay. Now, if you want to change your prompts here, all you have to do is to delete this and then enter again another or more prompts. For example, paint a picture of a Boston city, street touring, the rush or and so on. Same thing, you just have to select a style for this one, I want to use anime and then I want to exclude images like bicycle. I also want to exclude darkness. I want to exclude blurry background, poorly drawn face and actually everything is up to you. 
aspect ratio, I want to use square. And once done, click this generate button. So wait for a couple of seconds and this is the result. Very amazing, right? It's fantastic. And if you want to download this, you just have to click save. And actually, if you want to explore more, and then you can go to explore button and you will see here tons of images and ideas. For example, if you want to create an image like this, and then you can save this, you can use this one. You can use this images because uh, these are from uh, the GenCraft community. You can also go to creations if you want to see all the pictures and images that you have created. My uploads, if you have uploaded any image or creation here, so you can see it inside my library. And also, if you want to search a specific keyword or image to simply get an idea or something, you can just go to the search bar or search menu and then type something. For example, you want to look for images or creation related to anime. And all you have to do is to tap and then search. And, you know, you can use this images if you want. You can also follow users, for example, this user or this person created wonderful images and creations and you can follow him or her so that if this person posted something, then you are updated. Also for models, if you have created one, but actually this one is for upgraded plan. So you need to upgrade your plan to train models. Okay, so if you want to see more and explore more, you can go to the interface of GenCraft. You will see your picture. Apart from that, you can also see her community. Okay, so you can like, or if you appreciate uh, their work, then you can set this heart icon here. Okay, and follow them if you want. See more details, tap details. Free if you want to know or see free images, then you can tap free. Or art if you want to see more arts, like 2D art or color black or paper art. And for my models, if you have unlocked your model feature here in your GenCraft, or if you can start train your model, which is you need to upgrade your plan, like what I've mentioned earlier. So in conclusion, GenCraft offers a very potent and simple method for anyone to use AI to transform their ideas into beautiful visual content. With basic language inputs, the most advanced AI models can generate imaginative and photorealistic images, films, and artwork quickly. GenCraft is poised to transform the artistic and content creation industries with its diverse variety of applications, cross-platform compatibility, vibrant community, and cost-effective pricing. So if you have found this video helpful, please do like and subscribe because it helps me reach more people. See you soon.